Now, among the possibilities, and um, I'm not making any of these decisions unilaterally. If you guys want to do this stuff, we'll do it. Among the possibilities is that we would crowdfund 2015. And the way we would crowdfund it would be this. Uh, we, would, uh, we would do crowdfunding for about $200,000. About 100000 would go towards closing the gap and paying off the rest of the year. And the other $100,000 would pay me a salary, which is a decimal point of what I used to make. But I have not taken a salary uh, since I ended my contract at CBS in April 2012. Now, that is one way we could do it. Another way is to see the increase in revenue from you guys. And when I say the increases in revenue, obviously, you know, we've got... Think about this. We've got 150,000 unique listeners. And about 1% of you are subscribers. Are you hearing me? About 1% of you. 99% of you are not subscribers. And that is going to have to change between now and the end of the year. Beg, borrow, steal. Do it monthly. Do it yearly. Do it any way you want. But this is when it's going to have to happen, folks. Because I'm not going to incur any losses in 2015. Period. Now, I'm making it clear to you right now. Love you all. Love what we've accomplished. Loved what we've proven. But I'm going to be honest with you, and I've been honest before, but I'm being honest again. Listen carefully. Uh, this is not a charity case, this is not a charitable venture. Uh, we are here to make money, and I am an entrepreneur. And I have not made any positive cash flow on an annual basis since the end of my CBS contracts. That would mean 2012, 2013, and right now we're in 2014. We have to see profit. There is no point being here and beating our heads against the wall if we're not going to see a profit. Now... If you guys have ideas, if you guys have suggestions, if you guys have questions, I will answer them. I will listen to you. I have always been transparent here. And I am being transparent now. I don't make empty threats. I'm not here to be like a PBS or public radio telling you. I'm showing you the numbers. I'm telling you what's going on here. And um, we're the closest we've ever been to breaking even. And... I definitely believe it's completely within the realm of possibility, if not likelihood, that we will close this gap between now and the remaining four months of this year. You guys sold out the Palm for our, our dinner. Uh, when we did the steak dinner at the Palm, Boys Night Out. You guys sold out the Dodger game we did at $300 a ticket. What more can I ask than that? Um, when we did our second anniversary party, uh, at Bardot, uh, the nightclub in Hollywood. Um, many of you guys signed up and subscribed. And we're going to have more parties, which will uh, be free or lower cost for P1s. And the idea will be to generate more subscribers uh, to get more people under the tent. I will tell you, if you sign up to subscribe today, uh, you will get all of those benefits, and you will save us the trouble of having to make a big stink uh, about this toward the end of the year. Because I, 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 I mean it when I say that um, if we're not going to make a profit, I'm not going to embarrass or humiliate myself. I'm going to say we gave it our best shot. And I'm going to move on to, I don't even know if I'll move on to anything else. This may be the last thing I do.